four capacitors, two nanofarad each, are connected in series to a six-volt battery. Find their equivalent capacitance, the charge on each capacitor, voltage across each capacitor, and the charge passing through the battery during charging. The capacitors are in series to find the equivalent capacitance. We use the 1 over equation, so that 1 over C equivalent is 1 over C1 plus 1 over C2, etc. And they are all the same, so they are all 1 over 2, and then you got 4 of these, so 1 half times 4. And this gives us 2. When we have capacitors in series, this 1 over equation gives us an equivalent capacitance that is smaller. Because the capacitors are all the same, the equivalent capacitance is basically 2 nanofarad divided by 4, because there are 4 of those, which is 1 half, of course. Of course, this is 1 over C equivalent, so the C equivalent is 1 over 2 nanofarad. When capacitors are in series, they share the voltage. Because they are identical capacitors, that means they share the voltage equally. That means the voltage across each capacitor is 6 volts divided by 4. So this is 1.5 volts. To find the charge on each capacitor, we can just do Q equals to CV, and that's the capacitance of each capacitor 2 nano times the voltage across each capacitor 1.5 volts. So this gives us 3 nano coulombs. When capacitors are in series, they have the same charge. So the charge on each capacitor is also the charge on the equivalent capacitor, which is also the charge pumped by the battery. So this is also 3 nanocoulombs. In this case, the battery only pumps charges onto one pair of plates, this plate and that plate. So the charges passing through the battery during charging is 3 nanocoulombs, the charge on one capacitor. Four capacitors, 2 nanofarad each, are connected in parallel to a 6-volt battery. Find their equivalent capacitance, the charge on each capacitor, voltage across each capacitor, and the charge passing through the battery during charging. When capacitors are in parallel, we use uh, C equivalent equals to C1 plus C2, etc. So we add all the capacitance together to get the equivalent. There are four of those, so it's 2 nanofarad times 4, which is 8 nanofarad. When capacitors are in parallel, they all get the same voltage, and they all get the same 6 volts. So the voltage across each capacitor is 6 volts. And that means uh, to find the charge on each capacitor, we can use uh, Q equals to CV. We use the capacitance for each capacitor, 2 nano, times the voltage for each capacitor, 6 volts. So this is uh, 12 nano coulombs. When capacitors are in parallel, they share the total charge. So the Q equivalent, or the charge pumped by the battery, is the sum of the charges on all four capacitors. Each one has 12 nanocoulombs, so this is 12 nanocoulombs times 4, 48 nanocoulombs. Of course, we can also find this by finding the Q equivalent, which is C equivalent times the V, and the C equivalent is 8 nano. The voltage is the battery, 6 volts. So this is also, of course, 48 nanocoulombs. In this circuit, there are six capacitors, two nanofarad each, connected like this to a six volt battery. Please find these quantities. To find the equivalent capacitance, we can start with the three in series. 
To find those three in series, we have to use the one over equation, which means the equivalent capacitance is smaller. And since there are three identical ones, that means we just divide the two nanofarad by three. And then you have the same two of those in parallel. When they are in parallel, we would add them. Since they are, again, identical, we can just multiply this by two. Four thirds nanofarad. And that's the C equivalent. To find the voltage, we can first look at these two segments. They are in parallel. So each segment gets the same six volts, six volts. And uh, they are three identical ones in series. They share the voltage evenly. So the voltage across each capacitor is uh, six volts divided by three. So two volts each. This means the charge on each capacitor will be C times V, the C of each capacitor, two nano, times the voltage across each capacitor, two volts. So this is uh, four nanocoulombs each. The charge pumped by the battery is also the charge on the equivalent capacitor. And that's uh, C times V, the equivalent capacitance times the voltage. The equivalent capacitance is uh, 4 thirds nano. And uh, the voltage is uh, 6. So this is uh, 8 nano coulombs. In this case, the battery has to pump charges onto these two plates and uh, those two plates. So the battery has to pump charges onto two sets of plates. That's why the charge pumped by the battery is 8 twice the charge on each capacitor.